Hi, I'm Karmi Shammas. I'm your astrologer. Today I'll be talking about the last day of uh, the year of the month of December. Today is Sunday the 31st of December. The moon is in Leo for the third consecutive day, but it stays in Leo only till noon time, universal time. After that, it moves to uh, Virgo. So if you're watching me from the Americas, the moon will already be in Virgo when you wake up. So it's going to be uh, kind of different. So um the moon in uh, in uh, in leo actually helps a lot uh those born uh, if they were if they were born under the sign of uh, aries leo and um, sagittarius but the moon uh, with the moon in Virgo, it's going to be a super, super gorgeous day. If you're Virgo, if you're uh, Capricorn, if you're Taurus, there would be a grand trine between the moon, between Capricorn, the sun, and between uh, Jupiter and um, also uh, Uranus. So it's going to be a beautiful, gorgeous day. The 1st of January, the moon will be also in Virgo. So pay attention to that and uh, plan accordingly. Let's break down this day. Aries, uh, definitely the moon in uh, in a fire sign is very helpful the vibes are perfect and i think you can do a lot you can enjoy this beautiful day um and definitely you have nothing to worry about it's going to be a nice day especially when the moon is in leo but uh, make plans plan plan b maybe uh when the moon moves to virgo because it's going to be more demanding and it's going to be a little bit uh, uh, not rough but very busy and you'll be very very active you will need the help of others also taurus is going to turn out to be a beautiful beautiful uh sunday uh, the um, let's say that the new year's eve is going to be more than beautiful and I'm talking astrologically, it's going to be uh, very rewarding, very happy, and it will extend, these beautiful vibes will extend till um, Monday, the 1st of January. So it's going to going to turn out to be a beautiful uh, night, uh, beautiful eve, and you will be um, a very positive um, part of uh, making uh, this day a success. Uh, Gemini try to get things done while the moon is in uh, Leo. When the moon moves to uh, Virgo, you may feel a little bit worried because you want to have everything perfect. You're calling, you're making some calls, you're checking on everything, on the food, on reservations, on whatever it is. Try to enjoy, relax, take a deep breath and try, let it go, flow with it, enjoy. There's nothing wrong with this day or Eve. But if, if you were born on the 17th, 18th of June, try to take it easily, easy and try not to get into conflicts at all. Cancer, it's going to be a happy day, happy evening. Uh, the moon in Leo, the moon in Virgo, they're very happy for you. They're very, very, very um, cooperative, let's say. Uh, you will be quite busy. You'll get uh, so many ideas. You'll be very active, very um, uh, optimistic. And this is how you're going to cross to the new year. So that's great. Enjoy and help others enjoy their day and their eve also. Leo with the moon in your sign, definitely you're going to uh, begin the day with a great spirit, meaning you're going to be um, um, uh, optimistic, happy, and you want things to uh, move on fast. The moon moves to um, to Virgo and you will be also, you will still be uh, very happy and uh, you will be more excited probably. So all in all, it's going to be a beautiful day, beautiful evening, and this will extend also till to Monday. So help others also enjoy this beautiful day. You may uh, have some decision uh, making to do, and uh, maybe there will be some initiatives from you, from your part. Virgo, don't expect anything to turn out to be perfect while the moon is in Leo. But then when the moon moves to uh, Virgo, your sign at uh, 12 noon, universal time, everything will be more than perfect, ideal. It will be perfect. Uh, the moon in your sign in trine with the sun and in trine also from Jupiter and Uranus will help you enjoy one beautiful, gorgeous day, beautiful eve and beautiful 1st of January. So I think everybody's going to enjoy this beautiful day just make plans accordingly and if you were born on the 26th 27th of august be careful all day long especially when the moon is in leo 
uh, Libra, it's uh, a fine day as long as the moon is in Leo, because after that things will stall, uh, things, everything will be almost on hold and you will need someone to help you get things done and you will need somebody actually uh, to help resolve certain issues, to double check on certain points and uh, to be your second eye or your third eye, whatever. Uh, no pun intended. So all in all, uh, try to get things done while the moon is in uh, Leo because the moon in uh, Virgo is not going to be helpful. It's going to be kind of uh, uh, of uh, uninspiring, uh, kind of uh, bored and uh, kind of uh, desperate to, to go to sleep. So uh, take this into account. It's not going to be an easy afternoon or easy eve. Um, New Year's Eve. The same thing will extend to the, to the 1st of January. So don't ruin your night. Don't ruin uh, others' nights. Okay? Take this into account. Moving to Scorpio, it's going to be a beautiful day, beautiful eve, beautiful 1st of January. Everything will be great. Uh, a little bit tired, maybe while the moon is in Leo, but then everything will... Um, uh, reveal itself everything will be easy and everything will sort itself out it's going to be very active very open um uh, new year's eve and uh, i think you're going to enjoy the, the the company of others or whatever you're doing it's going to be quite fun um if uh if you were born uh, on the 17th 18th of november planet venus will be in your sign near your birthday and it will send you the best of vibes the best of vibes sagittarius uh, be careful when the moon moves to um uh to virgo but before that the moon in uh, the moon in leo is very interesting it's very helpful it's very kind it's very empowering and it will almost it will help you get anything you want when the moon moves to um when the moon moves to virgo you'll get a little bit busy you'll be responsible about something you will worry about something and you're not into that you just want to enjoy your evening and i think you will but planet mars is in your um, sign and it's near your birthday be extra careful drive very carefully if you were born on the 18th 19th of december be careful capricorn definitely uh, the best time during this day is when the moon reaches uh, virgo that's when everything seems to be more than perfect this is when you seem to enjoy what's happening that's when you get the trine uh, also from uranus and jupiter so you'll be the king the queen of the party the evening the day and even the first of january so take this into account but be a little bit more careful if you were born on the 20th of uh, january January, that's because of planet Pluto's vibes. Aquarius, the moon in um, Leo was really tough on you, was not kind at all uh, on Friday, neither on Saturday, and it's still bothering you till 12 noon universal time. After that, you will be free. You will get um, the opportunity, the chance to have some fun. Try to have some fun. Otherwise, you will spend a very... Um, um, calm and uneventful uh beautifully eventful um, new year's eve so whatever it is it's going to be better than the past two days today is going to be better than the past two days under the uh, influence of the moon in virgo okay so be careful in the morning okay let's move now to pisces pisces uh, you have to know that new year's eve is ruled by the opposition of the moon to your sign so there may be some trouble starting 12 noon universal time unless you grow up you mature about it and you ignore any uh, any any um any moodiness or any uh, thing that bothers you, uh, that annoys you so be careful especially if you were born on the uh, let me say if you were born between the 19th and the 23rd, you have to be extra careful today if you want to enjoy this beautiful um, special date. Uh, so stay away from conflicts. Don't get involved. This is your best bet, not only today, but also the 1st of January. Let's wrap it up with born on the 31st of December. And let me add born on the 1st of January. Uh, both of you, will, I think astrologically, you have beautiful 
events waiting for you uh, you will enjoy a beautiful year eventful beautifully eventful very inspiring uh, most probably you will get the benefits also from another trine from uranus also from jupiter which will help you be very um, uh, successful um, uh, very inspired very happy great news and great projects wishing you all the best and I wish you all a happy new year. Enjoy your day and see you tomorrow. Enjoy. Bye-bye.